Choose your character! What's up guys and welcome back to PKG. Today is our least favorite poison type, type of the month video. Yay. Yeah. Poison yeah. types. Poison types. Woo. All right. If you haven't watched our uh, other episodes, then go watch them. Uh, we're doing type of the month every single month. Sometimes we throw some gens in there. Eventually we'll probably throw some like trainers in there and stuff like that just to kind of spice it up a little bit. But right now we're doing type of the month poison. And yeah, so we're going to go through our top five with an honorable mentions after that. And then we'll battle. Ta-da. Type of them. Yay. Okay. My number five is Dust Docks. That thing is a piece of hot garbage. Its base stat totals 385. It evolves from a worm pole. <laughs> It's just bad. Yeah, it is bad. Like, when we're talking about bug poison types, this is, is the worst of them all. Um, so yeah, Dust Docks, terrible. 385 base stat total. He's not even relevant. Um, I think the only good thing about it is that it can learn Psybeam. Yeah. But I guess we'll see when I have to use it later. All right, my number five... Is it a bad Pokemon? Oh, I, now you're pulling I, a me. <laughs> I just hate him because of what he did to my team in the uh, in the series we're currently doing, Ruby and Sapphire Nuzlocke, and that's a lot. Uh, and uh, it killed me a couple times, and it pissed me off, and that's why it's my number five, no higher, because it's not a bad Pokemon. Base stats is 467. Um, it's really good if you want to annoy somebody. It's shiny is actually pretty cool that it turns blue, kind of like the in the other episode we were talking about with the Nido King turning that kind of blue. It's kind of close to that blue. Yeah, I I I don't hate the design. It's weird, but I don't hate it. It kind of fits the mold of a poison type. But yeah, I hate him because he slept my team a couple of times. So the only reason I hate him. <laughs> yeah. So funny story. So lots my number four. Please come back. Please come back. Please come back. Oh. You're like, your movement's fine. Can like, you hear me? I can, can hear you, you now. Go, 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 go. <laughs> uh, Swalot, number four. <laughs> so save as Vikes, number five. So yeah. So total is 467. I don't know. He just monotype. I don't like his design. I think he's stupid. I guess he's okay. Me. I don't know. But yes, like Michael said, he ruins a lot. It's like uh, he ruined Michael a couple times. And the thing is, is like in the early stages of the game, he evolves at level twenty, which is nice. And it gets sludge super early, so it like is able to do some good damage. But after that, it's just a bad Pokemon, and it's super fucking annoying. True, that yeah, I hate the fact that you sludge so early. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah. All right, my number four is Quillfish. Um, I do not like Quillfish. I think it's dumb that it doesn't evolve. They should have given an evolution. Like its design's not terrible, but I just I don't understand. I can't. I do understand why it's a poison type, but I don't at the same time. Like I understand that the points of its head and stuff like that are supposed to be poisonous, but I just I don't like that it doesn't evolve. Its base stats are not terrible. They're four forty for a mono like a no evolution Pokemon. That's not that bad, but its move pool is not that good. It just can basically learn everything that a water type can learn, and then like a little bit of poison type moves, and that's it. So it doesn't can't really learn that much. Space stats aren't that good. And I just there's so many better water poison types. Nice. Um, so I did just realize my list was just a list and I didn't actually rank them. <laughs> <laughs> 
So I'm going to probably re-rank them at the end, but I'll try my best to do it properly right now. Um, so my number three... I'll just I'll just read it off as one of mine. Uh, so Viper, uh, based that total of four fifty eight, it's not a bad Pokemon. It actually is quite annoying to fight. That's why I don't like it. Um, I remember playing Calcium and XD, and you run into a Viper, and if you let it attack, it's gonna hurt you with like a Poison Fang or a Poison Tail, and it's about to fuck up your day. Um, yeah, I just I also just don't like it. I think it's just a another Arbok, but just not as good. I do like the Viper and Zangoose, like Mongoose and Viper rivalry they do, but I don't know. It just, it's just one of those Pokemon that you just don't need. And it, it's just, a, it's also a, game, a Pokemon that it's like, it's not good, but yet when you fight it, it's annoying and it's probably going to hurt you. And it's just like, fuck off. Like you suck. I hate you. Get that out of my face. <laughs> so, yeah. Speaking of Coliseum, we're going to start twitching it. So if you want to watch us live and watch us be idiots, not over a recorded thing, and watch us live and comment and ask us questions, go check us out on Twitch. Uh, we're going to try that pretty soon here. Hopefully get that running within the next couple of weeks or a month here. But yeah, if you guys want to check that out, make sure you check that out. But yeah, moving on go, to sorry, go follow us on social media because we will post when we will be doing that. So make sure you go and check that out. Yeah, the halfway through the video plug. There you go. Um, yeah. <laughs> my number three is Dustox as well. Um, I, yeah, <laughs> I agree with Evan on everything. It's just, it's the, in my opinion, it's the worst butterfly, like rendition they made. I hate. I don't like. I like. I don't like them. Yeah. But I think Dustox is definitely the worst of the worst. I don't <laughs> like its design. Beautyfly is so much better. In my I eyes, mean, it's it's not so much better, but it is better. It is better, like you said. Stats are bad. I don't like its move set very much, other than side beam, like you said. I just, eh, to me, like it's shiny. Is <laughs> it's shiny is cool, but other than that, yeah. it's just like eh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my number two. This list is real. F- fucked but let's just quillfish yeah yeah i'll re i'll rearrange them at the end quillfish so based that total of 440 i like its concept it's a poison puffer fish makes sense it just is it relevant it doesn't evolve it's not a good pokemon it just it's another water type i don't know it just there, and that's the thing a lot of pokemon like yes not every Pokemon can be good, and there needs to be a variety. There needs to be bad Pokemon. But Quillfish is just, again, one of those Pokemon. Just take it or leave it. Don't need it, or you do. Like, And really, nobody needs it. So get rid of it. It's not a good Pokemon. So That is, that is fair, yes. I mean, that's why he's on my list, too. All right. My number two is Amoongus. God damn it. It's just a vile plume, but worse. <laughs> it's just annoying. It's annoying as hell. Its base stats, again, are not that bad at 464. Like, poison types don't have bad base stats. So people are going to, like, think that, oh, yeah, you guys are picking Pokemon that have decent base stats. But, like, poison types just generally have decent, like, base stats. So, that's well, kind of... If you go, if you go and look at our fave video... Uh, like I have my faves just above my least faves. Mm-hmm. Their base stat totals range from 480 to 500. Yeah, like it's not that far off of the of the least faves. Dustox is probably like the worst. Three, the 385. Yeah. That's that's bad. The other ones are decent, and it's just bad Pokemon to have decent base stat. <laughs> But yeah, I, mean, I like I like like I was saying, I don't like its move pool. It's a Pokemon that's used to fuck around with people and annoy people. Um, I like what they did with Pokemon Sword and Shield and making it like a Mega Mushroom, but like disguised. Like that was kind of cool. But other than that, like there's nothing. Wait, what? I swear they did that, didn't they? No. Oh, I thought they did. I swear I did that. Okay. But yeah, I don't know. It just 
It's a trash Pokemon. It's basically Vile Plume, but stupider. I hate his design. It's stupider. Just... Stupider, yeah. That's a stupider word. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. It's a Vile Plume, but more stupid. Thank you. Um, <laughs> his design is lazy, in my opinion. Like... Like, why yeah. is there Voltorbs on its hands and on its head? Like, it's so weird. No. It's not Voltorbs, like, it was like Pokeballs. <laughs> I know. I'm just fucking I think all this Pokemon is, is they needed another Voltorb for black and white. So mm-hmm. it's like, if you click on this Pokemon, it's actually a static. And it's just this annoying fucking mushroom. Like, Voltorbs are annoying, too. Fuck Voltorbs. <laughs> and they self-destruct on you? Fuck. But yeah. All right, honorable mentions. Uh, my honorable mentions uh, have Venomoth. It's not that bad of a Pokemon. I actually don't mind it. The problem is the other bug poison type. It is cool that a psychic type moves, so good for it. Um, that's why it's not on my top least faves. Um, the only thing that's ended it in with it is the idea of uh, the Butterfree line and this like the Venomoth line, Butterfree and Venomoth technically should have been switched because if you look at Venonat and Butterfree, they're the same. And if you look at Venomoth and Metapod, they look the exact same. They should have just, they they swapped it. They must have. The designs are too similar to the other line, but I don't know. I just think Venomoth is another bug poison type and it's not even that good of a Pokemon. It just has a better move pool than other bug poison types. So, um, and then I have Galarian Weezing. I didn't like Weezing to begin with. Galarian Weezing is just stupid. Like the design, sure, it's different. They're they're whatever those smoke tunnel things are coming out of his head, and they're top hats. Cool. And he's sophisticated as shit. Fuck off. Poison Fairy is a cool typing. I like that. But Weezing is just a shit Pokemon and fuck this Pokemon. I don't like it. <laughs> I feel like they wasted fairy poison as a typing yeah on, on that. that yeah like they should have i hope they make other ones maybe in the next gen that are cooler but like that... imagine imagine this okay so hatterene it's fairy psychic okay it's pretty much just another gardevoir and then mm-hmm. valerian rapid ash is same thing psychic fairy they could have made hatterene poison fairy and instead of it having like psychic stuff inside of it, it's like poisonous and it like leeches out and like attacks you, but then it also has like fairy abilities and shit. Like that would be cool. They could have easily done that. That wasn't even that far off. But no, they decided to make another fucking Gardevoir. Well, they also could have even if they just made Galarian Rapidash, its horn be poisonous. Like it's not that hard to do. Nah, so you had to make that f- psychic fairy. I'm okay with that. It's a unicorn. That's fair. All right, I have one honorable mention, and it's Area Dose. Nice. Um, don't get I me thought wrong. about it. I thought about it, but I actually kind of like Area Dose. I love Spinarak. I think it's fucking adorable, and I think that uh, it will forever be amazing. And I should have put it on my favorite list just because it's so damn cute. But Area Dose, its base stats only four hundred, which is for Poison standards apparently really bad. Um, its moveset is just meh to me. Um, in Pokemon XD, Spinarak's one of the first Pokemon you catch. So you obviously, when you're a kid, you use the first Pokemon you catch. And then you realize how bad Ariados can be. <laughs> yeah. Especially, well, and then you can also get an Ariados, I think, in Coliseum. Yeah, you can. But like, let's be honest. Stupid. Let's be honest. It's too late in the game. You're not using it. <laughs> yeah. So, 30? I think so, yeah. But yeah, so oh, Spinarak, big thumbs up. Ariados, fuck you. <laughs> All right, Evan, give us your number one. All right, my number one is Amoongus, because it's the only one left on my top five that I haven't said yet. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like you said earlier, stupid fucking garbage Voltor looking piece of shit. Um, it's annoying. It's like the Zubats of Statics, him and Fungus. It's based that total is 464, so it's actually not that bad. But it's a, it's a grass poison type. 
it's just a waste of a Pokemon. The name is fucking stupid. When I looked up Amoongus in the Google search, it, it thought I was looking up Among Us. <laughs> oh, I got fucking heated about that. <laughs> I don't even know why. I just think it's stupid. <laughs> um, but yeah, Amoongus, just not a good Pokemon in my mind. It's just another grass poison type. There's so many better options. And this thing is just an annoying piece of garbage. So yeah, there you go. Speaking of annoying garbage, my number one is Garbodor. <laughs> ah, I'm offended. Um, it's just it's just another muck. It's what muck probably should have been, honestly. See, no, 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 no. I'm actually gonna defend Garbodor because a lot of people talk shit about it. I actually like the idea of Trubbish and Gar- Garbodor. Muck, muck is cool. I like muck. I think muck's a great Pokemon. Okay, but they're different. Garbodor, sure, the design isn't great because he's just trash. It's, it's always trash. But I actually kind of like Garbodor. It's a cool concept. I like his G-Max for him. I'm not saying he's a good or my favorite Pokemon. I think he's still not good. But I will defend him in this regard because I don't think he's that bad. Anyway, his base stats are 474. Again, not that bad for Poison Standards. I just, I think it's annoying. <laughs> like, I play these games. I think it came out in black and white, right? Yeah. I've started playing those games. I fight it all the time. And it just annoys me. Even just looking at it annoys me. Like, it's just, it's literally just a piece of trash over and over and over again. Yeah. I just, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should have put it as like my four or five, but like I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. I was gonna get mad at you, be like, "Don't you dare compare him to Muck. Muck is so much better than that garbage." <laughs> I mean, it is. Yeah. Um, so if I had to realistically list these, one, two, three, four, five, I'd probably go. My number five would be um, Sviper. My number four, Swalot. Uh, three, Quillfish. Two, Dustox. And number one, Amoongus. Okay. Well, I'm not so sure. you'll, you'll edit that. Just list. Yeah, I'll list it differently. Properly. Because I fucked it up. I'm sorry. It's okay. I sent that her. These are the easiest things I did on the planet. All right. So... That is going to be it for the talking portion. Now you're probably getting to the part where you're more excited about. That's going to be our battle. We're going to go into Pokemon yeah. Showdown. We're going to battle. See who has the better, worst team, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The loser but, technically has the Let's best. see who sucks the most. <laughs> but yes, if, if, if that was the case, I'd have a lot more wins. But Mike would be winning. <laughs> <laughs> But yes, let's get into that battle. Ready? Three, two, one. Bat. Core on this computer. All right. Accept the challenge. All right, guys. We're now in the battle here. As Evan has his Pokemon up there. My Pokemon are down here. You can see what I'm doing. So if I make a mistake, you can call me out in the comments. I don't really care. (laughs) But yeah. Let's. (laughs) Let's. <laughs> Alrighty then. Alrighty then. Let's get right into the battle. Ah, oh, yeah. Same these. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, same these. <laughs> oh, my God. No, same. <laughs> Jesus. Guess I'll do it again too. <laughs> All right. Come on. Oh. Mm-hmm. Not to mention, Dust Doctor is fucking slow. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Why would you die on him? Jesus. Oh, fuck yeah. Focus Sash. I knew that was going to come in handy. Damn, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what the funny thing is? I have the same fucking strategy. 
That's awesome. Not with Quillfish, though. Uh... What? Good job, oh, Psychic Terrian. I, I didn't know. I don't know what the terrains do. That's actually super fucking frustrating. Um, well, I'm absolutely fucked. Uh, I, I guess. I should have just attacked you, but whatever. <laughs> Bounce. That's what you use the power herb on? Mm -hmm. Fucking hell. Okay, well, um, Yikes. Okay. Look at that majestic blue color. Told you it was majestic. <laughs> Kacha. Oh. Got you, bitch. <laughs> oh, oh, that was rude. Uh, and the crit. All right. Thanks for paralyzing for me. Not. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I didn't get to kamikaze with him too. <laughs> All right, let's go, boys. Dunk shot, interesting. I like it. Oh God! <laughs> Seven boys. Here we go. Oh, you woke up, you little bitch. Fuck. Uh, that's not okay. Yeah. Fuck. Why don't you miss? Well, you're going to be... Wow, that did nothing. Explosion! <laughs> I, love it. I fucking love it, Mike. That was, that was oh, I didn't know that. Levitate. I didn't know that. <laughs> it's okay. We got it. Oh. Another one. <laughs> You're gonna oh win. Oh my god. <laughs> You're gonna win because of this fucking wheezing. Oh fuck. I don't know what to do. Um yeah, I guess. Oh you're faster. Yikes. It's too bad I made my fucking quillfish a physical attacker, so there's nothing I can really do to you now. Yeah. Aha, man, speed faster. But I do more damage. <laughs> How much are you doing? 14? Oh, do you get a crit? No. Oh, no, the brick kills you. <gasps> oh. <laughs> do you know what I was going to do? Use explosion? 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had three guys with explosion. I had two. <laughs> I, should, I shouldn't have used it with so lot, but I was like, fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. I was like, fuck it. You're probably going to kill me next turn anyway. Fuck it. <laughs> I love it. Well, that was good. I, I think that was a good close battle. I fucking sucked. <laughs> I just started fucking around. <laughs> yeah, no, it was like any Pokemon I had that could learn explosion. I was like, yep. <laughs> as soon as I like thought you might have killed me, I was like, yep. <laughs> <coughs> if you didn't Gigantamax, it would have worked better and I would have won, but Yeah, I, at the end there I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Like I need to do something. Like, I have to Dynamax. Like, if I don't, I'm fucked. Okay, what do you got here? Power Herb. That was actually kind of cool. I respect that move. Um, Stomping Tantrum, Gunk Shot, Spikes and Explosion, Rain Dance, Aqua Tail. So you use the Swift su- Swim. That's not a bad combo. I just forgot. I just didn't do anything with it. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, that's not a big deal. I, I went to the Intimidate one because I had a feeling that most of you guys were going to be physical attackers. So I was just like, Intimidate's a good ability. So it just helps, right? Dust Docks, yeah. I mean, I didn't run Energy Ball and Bug Buzz like yours, but it's pretty similar. Swallow, Liquid Ooze. Why did you use Liquid Ooze? I didn't. I felt the other ones weren't going to do shit either, so it didn't even matter. Well, to see with him, with him, like what I did, he used Gluttony, and then once he hits half health, he eats the berry that he's holding. So I just put a berry on. So you get like instantly healed. <laughs> yeah, true. But but I, I I see I understand what you're saying. You didn't see any purpose to it. And then a Moongus was so amusing. Yeah, so good. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay. Well, mine. <laughs> hopefully, I don't like leg out and what I'm telling you. Um. So for me, I my cool fish, I had a focus sash. You guys saw that because I wanted to be able to get an explosion off if I needed to. Um, he also had aqua jet, waterfall, and spikes, intimidate ability. Um, and then I had Swalot with the above berry and gluttony, like I was just telling Mike. He had earthquake, explosion, thunder punch, and ice punch. Yes, I wanted to use the explosion like I did, so that worked out nicely. So Viper, I'm disappointed in. I didn't realize the psychic terrain. I've totally forgot that that didn't... Like, I don't know terrains. I don't care I don't about them, so I never learned them. I didn't realize that was the thing with them. Um, but his move set... I really like Viper. I'm really disappointed I didn't get to use him because he had a life orb and shed skin ability, and then he had crunch, earthquake, sucker punch, and coil. And I was going to try to set up with that coil. Um, Amoongus... Uh, I think I pretty much showed you guys what my set was. It was like a sunny day synthesis set. And then I was using spore and facade just to get max damage off. Um, And then I had effect spore as well, just in case you hit me and spore wasn't working or get a para off or something like that. Uh, Dust stocks. So I had wise uh, wise glasses on them with the quiver dance, psychic shadow ball and roost. And then Galarian Weezing with the Salak Berry, Latability, Explosion, Gyro Ball, Will O Wisp, and Play Rough. So, yeah, that was cloud. Pretty straightforward. Yeah. It no. was very hard. I didn't want to use any poison type moves. <laughs> I, I did for the purpose that Amoongus was on your team so I could at least use it against him. But honestly, using Gunk Shot was smart because I I used Galarian Weezing and Amoongus, and they were both like they could both get hit by them, right? And then, see, instead of using Explosion with a lot, I probably should have just used Gunk Shot. <laughs> yes, but, yes, you should have. But I wanted uh-huh. to be I wanted to make it more fun and more interesting. <laughs> yes, that is fair. Um, but the. Uh, I was going to say something. Oh, yeah. When I was trying to decide between using Venomoth or Galarian Weezing, I was thinking, I'm like, oh, you know what? I might use Venomoth. Like, he'd be really good. He can learn Psychic. Like, 
all that stuff. And then I'm like, well, no, it's another dust ox. Plus, I don't want to be, <laughs> you guys always bug me about using the, like, the good Pokemon in the least favorite videos. So I was like, fuck it. I'll go for the Galarian Weezing. It might be a better Pokemon, but it's going to be worse for this because it's fairy type. So it's going to be shitty against poison types. And it turns out he's the one that won me the game. So I don't know how that would have went with Venomoth. It might have gone differently. I don't know. But there you go. Oh, my God. What? I just realized with Quillfish, I totally could have killed you. Why? Because I could have used the poison type move. I always get fairy and poison mixed up. Oh, yeah. In my head, because I always think, oh, yeah, fairy is super effective. Against no, it's not. I'm stupid. I could have no. won. Poison type is super effective. It's a fairy types. I could have won. I should have won. <laughs> I mean, I should have won if I didn't use explosion twice. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I did it too. But... Yeah. <laughs> and honestly, at the end there, if the burn didn't kill you, I was going to use explosion anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to be like, fuck it. <laughs> Yeah, that was just trying to have fun with it. So um, if you enjoyed yeah. the video and you sure enjoyed our shenanigans, uh, leave a like, leave a comment down below which poison type you absolutely despise. Like if you some for some reason hate Salazzle, tell us that you hate Salazzle down below and tell us why, even though you're probably wrong. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> even though you're probably wrong. Um, like us on social media, PCK Gaming, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitch. Uh, make sure you keep following us on those social medias to be ready for us talking about Twitch in the future. Um, yeah. And yeah, subscribe. We're 10 away from 100. And that's been our goal for 2021. That's what we want to get to. If we can get there before halfway through the year, maybe we can get to a, another goal of 150 to 200 by the end of the year. So if we can get first to that 100, it'll give us that confidence going up to 150 to 200. So Please subscribe. We'd really much appreciate it. But yes, yeah, sir. Thank you guys all for watching. We will see you all later. Bye, guys.